Alright, okay. Sean, K, K, Sean. K, what happened in the last episode of Obi Wan? Get no bad. So it was the recovery of Leia. Get no bad. Yet again. Sorry. Chill out. Sorry. Chill out. Um, Obi Wan went to a rescue Leia. Uh huh. Um. It was kind of ad it was kind of um, sad, I guess. Like seeing Reva like trying to emotionally manipulate a ten year old. Mm -hmm. Probably the most stubborn ten year old ever. Mm -hmm. But you know she held out. She was about to get tortured, and she was still standing strong. Mm -hmm. Good for her. Um, Obi Wan went in. He saved her. They flooded a part of the building to get out. Mm -hmm. Kind of seemed like he was getting more used to his, you know, lightsaber. Mm -hmm. uh, and they got rescued by rebels, I guess. I guess you could call them rebels. Mm -hmm. yep. Anything else? Vader turned up. Yep. Decided to you know, be, be awesome and like talk out Reva. But obviously he didn't actually, he didn't kill her because Reva put a tracker in. Leia's little droid. Lula. Lula. Yeah. It's pretty much it, isn't it? That's, pretty, that's all that, that episode was, was really, wasn't yeah. it? Just yeah. the rescue of Leia, of yeah. part two. Yeah. So this is episode five. Are we going to get a flashback yet? <laughs> so imagine if like all of episode six is just one big flashback. We need some flashbacks. I was expecting a lot of this to be flashback based, but <laughs> yeah. there's is, not is, been there's not been that much really, has there? Is that because you expected it to be like mostly him just in the desert going and that being just, it? Yeah. yeah, and then flashbacks. Hayden Christensen and Ewan McGregor fighting in the Clone Wars. I wouldn't complain, <laughs> to be perfectly honest. Bond. Studying this, studying the bond of of Leia and Obi Wan. People are saying they can't believe how sassy she is at 10 years old. And it's like, this is the woman who at 18 became a planetary politician, had like a full PhD at 19, was leading the rebellion at 20. It's like, really? If there's one person who would be damn proud, it would be Carrie Fisher. This Alderaan. No. <gasps> oh. 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 no! Hey! Ah, he's, oh my god, he's got the mullet. <laughs> As if we're literally just talking about flashbacks. I know. If that's all this episode is, I'll back and die happy. Oh. oh. Devastated. Ooh, is she gonna get made Grand Inquisitor? Grand Inquisitor. <gasps> Damn. So where's the other Grand Inquisitor? Where's the Set real the Grand Inquisitor? <laughs> <laughs> oh dear! Vader's coming and he's full of hell! Oh no, what's gonna happen? Vader's coming and he's full of hell! <laughs> That's James, I think it's James Earl Jones that voices Darth Vader. He's like 90 and he's still doing a mint job as Vader's voice. Is, it, is he actually voicing him, or is I'm it like sure, a voice modulator? No, I'm sure he is. He isn't the patient's for a siege. How do you know? I know! Oh, oh. oh is the entire episode just going to be flashbacks to this duel, I think? Don't grow too aggressive, Anakin. Be mindful. <laughs> it is, isn't it? It's just going to be the siege played out in the duel. It's like, it's, it's like how well they know each other, isn't it? Launch the attack. In this facility, if we defend our position together, then by the time they get inside, we'll be gone. You heard him. <laughs> yeah, listen, the general. Come on. He's not a general anymore. <laughs> He's just an old Jedi. I'm going to need a ladder. Ha! Stop playing tight right now. Do it, she us. Ha! You trust me? I trust her. Get her the ladder. Oh, look at her little face. 
Get her a ladder. I pray you're safe, Ooh. Ooh. Bale gonna go and see Luke. Thing is, he has been away from it will be. Luke for far too long. His whole point was that he was there. It's nice to know he's like, yeah, that's my daughter, but also we need to think about you know, the other child as well. This is the penultimate episode, so something big must surely happen in this episode. Back on Daiu, how did you know that? How? Vader would have kept that hidden. She saw him killing the other Jedi. Unless. Unless she was there. Unless you were there. It doesn't matter where I was. Yeah, it was. Are they gonna show us? <laughs> killing children. That was the five or first. You are hunting him. <gasps> Let me help you. Why Why trust to... trust you. Because we want the same thing. Do we? We do. Do you really want Anakin dead? Oh, that's actually quite interesting. I don't need your help. <laughs> you bloody do, like. You would say that, wouldn't you? You would like, listen, right? You might have killed the odd Jedi here and there. You might be able to cut the top tank. But this is between a Jedi and this, Darth Vader. This is Darth Vader you're talking about here. It's just a little bit too compact for me. Hmm? This is all very. You see how the camera's just a bit sort of wobbly. Yeah. This is going to go back to one of those points where these characters, i.e. that the, the last and Kunal and Jani, are not in any of the shores, so they surely can't survive. Wipe them out. Oh, the droid. Is he going to have like a self-destruct sequence or something? She's gonna like shoot the blast door down or something, isn't she? <gasps> because he's because she's holding a thermal death in it, huh? Make the force be with you. Oh, not bad. I not, mean not the worst death ever. Honor. Not the worst death ever. I just didn't like I didn't like where they were all sort of fighting, I didn't like shaky how, camera. Yeah, yeah, like it was shaky. Like, if someone's being awesome, I want to clearly see them being awesome. I think they tend to do it to, like, try and make it more real, don't they? Yeah. Uh, they try and make it as if it's sort of hectic and panicky, but it's like, I just want to see Jedi doing Jedi things. <laughs> Down. I Lord. guarantee, right? Kenobi is already ours. Oh? I guarantee. Oh, that was a throwback! That's what they were doing on emergency. I guarantee. Right. There's something else. He's, there's something Vera else. Vera knows that she's trying to kill him. It's exactly why he did what he did. He knew she wasn't dead in the temple, and, she's, and he's letting her. Letting her believe. That she has the upper hand. <gasps> Let her find it, that droid. I think the stormtroopers are there going, what are they talking about? <laughs> They're whispering. What is she talking to him about? God, is that what we're going to see? We're going to see him like just outsmarting them. I don't know why the Imperial March isn't playing. Where is he? Hey, hold on there. Now fix the bloody thing. Vader's coming at his bullet hole. Right now, everyone, why is no one on the ship yet? Everyone get on the bloody ship. Because they're all looking, you know, kind of like... <gasps> oh, what's he doing? 
I said it was full of hell. Oh my god. Oh my god. Bro isn't even using two hands. That is not even like trying. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, and Raver's just gonna Raver's just gonna beat him. What is Oh <gasps> Trickcha it's quite clever, actually, that that's what they're doing. And even as Vader, he's... feels an overwhelming need to prove himself to Obi-Wan. You know, he's already beaten, yeah. like, every other Jedi. I, I guess because, like, Obi-Wan <gasps> did... Fight between him, these two. He? Fight between these two? Well, that'll be cool. I doubt it'll last long. Yeah. And he's not even drawn his lightsaber. Is she going to use her lightsaber to kill her, do you think? Oh! It is! It's going to be a duel! He's not even going to use his own lightsaber, he's using her lightsaber. <laughs> he's just like, yeah, okay. I mean, he's just, like, you're not worthy of my lightsaber. Let me just take these Lego pieces to part. There you go. Not even looking at her. Oh, flashbacks. I think he's gonna do that. The Michigan is gonna come to Kua. Guys, if they're showing us more like him killing younglings. <laughs> She's gotta have a dramatic death. Did you really believe I did not see it, youngling? Knew it. Knew it. <laughs> oh, knew it. Just play her like you a fiddle. Are of no further <gasps> use. It is. <sighs> That's awesome. Revenge does wonders for the will to live, don't you think? <laughs> you That was the most pettiest thing I've ever seen. I loved every <laughs> second of it. She's not dead yet. They're just leaving her. So did he, did he actually did Obi, stab her? Did Obi-Wan leave? Surely she's gonna go to the not gonna go to the boy on Tatooine. But why would she go to Tatooine? Why would she do that? Yeah, it's weird, isn't it? She like went against Vader. I guess she's still an Inquisitor, but yeah, but why if, would she, why she, would if she if go I, if to I, Tatooine? If her goal was never actually to be an Inquisitor and was purely just to get back at Vader, going for Luke doesn't make. Because he doesn't even know Luke exists at this point. Ah. Oh, it's yeah, so weird, like what what goal would she have to go for Luke? I don't know, I haven't seen it. Maybe she's maybe she's still angry at Kenobi for leaving. But in that scenario she can't be angry he offered to help her. He said we'll do it together. They would have had no Why better opportunity to beat them than what they just had there. Unless it's something like she wants to train him or something. Take him and turn him into... I don't know. I don't know. So there's a few points, and people might think this is maybe not really critical, but I'm at the end of the day I want Star Wars to be the best. The best version of itself. Yeah. So I am overly critical of it. Um, when Obi-Wan was fighting off the Stormtroopers... It was a bit, a bit too shaky for my liking. Mm. Um, loved the flashback. Uh, I liked how that was the whole like episode. The whole episode was just them like understanding each other and you know he Vader really trying to draw him out. He's trying to use you know the people against him, but he's yeah. You know he's kind of like they're like. I liked, I liked that lass's death because like I said I, none of these characters are in yeah. any media following this program, so you know. Theoretically, most of them should be dying. Mm -hmm. As horrible as that is, but unless they pop up later on somewhere else, you've got to be pragmatic about these oh. things. Yeah. Um, there still hasn't been all that great of a lightsaber fight. Like that one there when they were fighting each other, Anakin and Obi Wan was 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 good. Um, it was cut though, wasn't it? So it wasn't like a yeah. continuous. The lightsaber fight, fight between 
Vader and Reaver wasn't even a lightsaber fight. But I know I know people's reactions to that will be, well, it's supposed to really emphasise that at no point was Reaver ever a threat to Vader. As mm. as you know, was fair. fair and fair I'm enough. glad they did that to be honest. Yeah. I, I, knew. Kind of, I feel like this whole series has just been like another way for them to go, okay. Vader is like a big deal. So they didn't have like the technology and the capabilities to do it in like the original, so it's like yeah. I like that the Grand Inquisitor's back. Mm-hmm. Raver isn't dead, so it's interesting to see where the show is going to go. There's only one episode left of this stuff. There's, like, there's yeah. a lot of arcs that need to be resolved I've, here. I mean, there's got to be a season two, surely. I, yeah. I, don't, I can't see them resolving everything. Plus, it's still quite early on in like the thing. Like, if you think about it, Leia's got to get back to Alderaan. He's got to get to Tatooine to protect Luke again. But is that so? Is that is that then going to go? All right. So from now on, Reaver's the main bad guy because Vader and the Grand Inquisitor aren't that bothered anymore. Just like, well, surely not. Surely Vader would still be pursuing as desperate to go after Obi Wan as as he always was. I imagine this is probably like the beginnings, like the like the the earliest beginnings of like the rebellion you know mm. like we might see like because if um if organa has gone to tatooine to like defend luke and they find him there surely that's going to cause issues and stuff and yeah. you know like i just I'm, I'm curious to know like why would Ra- i can't say why raver would go after luke like i say i guess you could still blame everyone for, for like abandoning her but like you say you gave her the option and she didn't go with it I was thinking when he was kneeling there, I thought he was going to show her what he did to try and stop him. Because mm. he did try and stop him. I mean, you know, he chopped his arm off, chopped his legs off, let him burn alive. Any normal human being would be like, well, that guy's, dead. That guy's pretty <laughs> dead. Like, but, you know, this is Anakin Skywalker, yeah. for goodness sake. Um, I like the look of Order 66 again. I liked seeing Anakin killing a bunch of kids. <laughs> <laughs> You actually um, saw it though. You didn't. Well, I you kind you didn't of saw really it. See it but. You kind of. You saw bits. I guess obviously they don't. They don't want to, you know, completely go like full. No. They don't want to show. Murderer. Yeah, child they, massacre. They didn't want to make it like too dark. Yeah. I guess it's still Disney after. There's just too much. There's too much bad. For surely, just Obi Wan. If Vader and the Grand Inquisitor are still chasing him, mm-hmm. that's two people he's gonna have to fight. He's got the full might of the yeah. Empire bearing down on him. He's also got Reaver, who's going to Luke for some reason. Why would she go for Luke? I don't understand. Unless it's something like she just wants to take him and train him. Like, maybe now she's thinking, okay, I can't take on Vader by myself. I need others like me. I'm going to find this child. I'm going to start finding four sensitive children and training them. Or just Jedi and training them instead of killing them. I would kind of be on board with that, but why would you go for a child that's ten who's... who? You know, he's not ready to fight Vader. Surely you would just try and find other Jedi. And a failed apprentice makes for a poor master. You know, Cobb Dooku, you said it. Um, yeah, that was us reacting to episode four of Obi-Wan. Five. But five, yeah, episode five. Let us know down in the comments what you think is going to happen. Um, let us know what you think in terms of criticisms. Do you think people are being overly cri- critical? Frankly, I don't care. I'm always going to be critical of Star Wars because yeah. I want Star Wars to be the best of itself. It doesn't mean it's bad. It just means it's like little... Yeah. I think it was just like more of like a creative choice with the camera with yeah. like the Stormtrooper fight. They were, it, obviously, it was to kind of make it more like like you were in it, like it was a bit more realistic, yeah. but... Yeah, I want to see Jedi really doing f- Jedi. I've never really been a fan of that kind of yeah. thing. Yeah. Let us know what you think down in the comments. Like the video, subscribe, ding the bell, be notified when we upload. We upload every day. Anything else you want to say? Do you know what, right? I still don't understand what the purpose of the spinning lightsabers are. Like, why? Flight. I know, but she, did, she wasn't using it for flight. She was like. Also means that, like, if you go like that, the can't just sort of. I know, but I'm, I'm kind of just like, well, this is just, just, it's just lazy. Like, just you know, be cool and like. Yeah. You've got to remember you know? these are like rejected padawans and all that stuff. I know, but it's like, how? Come on. Come on, guys. I mean, the Grand Inquisitor is a Jedi Temple guard. That's all he was. All he was? 
Get in your bed. It's an honour. I would rather be a temple guard than, was in one than of those, not a Jedi. It was in one of those people with the white masks that didn't do anything. It was, like it was a guard and in that time there was a false Jedi who just ran through and had to be stopped by another Jedi. There was, you know, attacks on the temple. There was break-ins at the temple. What did they do? And he thinks he's just going to wizard Obi-Wan Kenobi. Absolutely not. I would rather be a temple guard than, like, a rejected Padawan. At least, at least you get a lightsaber. And if I... A rejected Padawan would get a lightsaber? They wouldn't. Like, no, I'm, when I mean rejected Padawan, I mean, like, they're like, oh, yeah, you know. You it's can't like, well, Yeah, yeah you're, you're false sensitive, but... Hmm, like I, I, would, I would, Yeah, it's just like... Mm. Yeah. Because I feel like that would be me. I would, I would have a little bit, but they would kind of just be like... Mm. Yeah. Wouldn't be as uh, successful as your Jedi Master brother. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for watching. I need to know.